X-Men, X-Men. After so many years, we've been together for eight years. Wow, I got the color up a little high. Alright. Let me, let me go right back. I want to do something. I'll show you how the color is. Guys, I'm back. Let's make this a little bit better here. guy was talking about a headlock today, he thought I was going to get him in a headlock, some fat guy. But yeah, I can get him in a real strong headlock. It's like their mental case. I don't know if you guys are like that too, but just enjoy the, the show, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's definitely a different version, because the other one is there, it changes around, the controls. We're going all the way to the end of this one, baby. I am Colossus. Ah, the Russian. He's a good artist. He makes comic books, and his uh, sister is Eliana Rasputin, and he's Peter Rasputin. Nikolai Rasputin. He's always a big character, that's probably why he chose the last name. Pyro can make fire, uh, shape it and control it, but he can't make it. That's why he wears the gas in the back. He died as a death of Pyro. I was in, um, he died around. He, um, he died when uh, it was uh, zero tolerance, Operation Zero Tolerance. Yeah. There were some cute looking uh, half uh, sentinel, half uh, human girls in that one. Probably gonna go up the value soon. And I have the uh, Cerebro. I should make a uh, movie with Cerebro as a bad guy. I don't know whatever happened to Alex Summers still in the movie. He uh, supposedly disappeared. I think Mr. Sinister is gonna be the next one. I wanna be in that movie so bad. I love Mr. Sinister. I like, he's my favorite villain. He creates like all these clones and genetic mutations that like end up turning on him at the end. He's great. He's so clever. He never got he never got killed. 
one of the most clever bad guys. He always knows how to escape. Not particularly strong, strong, but he does get, he has his henchmen in him. He created uh, the Marauders. He's trying to steal a cheap, um, Jean Grey and Scott Summers for the genetics. And then he, when they have that baby in uh, the future or whatever, they, uh, he steals the baby. Table is like he, X Man is actually a clone of uh, Jean Grey and uh, Scott Summers, amped up clone that Sinister made, and uh, he has like ultra telepathic and telekinetic powers. It's like the best of both worlds. It'd be cool if they gave him the legacy virus like Cable. Cable is the, is the son too. But for some reason Cable only has telekinetic. Actually Cable does have telepathic powers too. But they're not as strong. Cables in this. He's one of the most underrated characters right now. Even though they put him in uh, Deadpool, he's still. They're probably working on a cable movie. But if they're not, then he's still underrated. There's so much they can do with like the 80s. Oh, it's like endless the movies they can make. Failing. Cameron Hodge. <laughs> They even include like uh probably they didn't put the absorbing man in the full movie either yet. He was like a big potential for he's a beast. They can do mimic too. Oh my god. It's all about the music. They just gotta make the music more eighties like retro like techno. Kind of like ah, uh -huh. <coughs> but like with, that goes with the scene. It. I got all the best ideas. I'd make a freaking awesome X-Men movie. We could do Asteroid M too. Age of Apocalypse. Well, they they did a good job on the Apocalypse movie, but it was nowhere near as good as it could be. Beginning of uh, Days of Future Past was like the best part of the movie. Then it was like so shitty after that. But it showed like the the, 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 the alternate dimension with, with Blink and uh, Bishop or whatever. Tension was just like crap. The Age of Apocalypse Sentinels, the green ones are the best. They're so cool with them. They've got like Atlantean look to them, like that sea foam green. Atlantean look to them. And even the Apocalypse kind of look like an Atlantean god. Instead, as a 
an interesting, some kind of like cyborg watcher or something that ended up becoming, you know, like, like an AI, so to speak, like, that was, had a little bit of human in him to keep him to the knowledge of the human race and then he just became apocalypse like that they should all be destroyed. Only the strong survivor apocalypse. Somehow we saw the demons as the uh, future because they're stronger, not because he's necessarily a mutant. And then they have him as his technology, the suit, and the newer ones in the comic book. So I like Age of Apocalypse better. He was like more robotic and shit. And Holocaust, that was an awesome fucking bad guy. It's like a spirit in the soul, almost like a freaking transformer. Wendigo, I'm gonna use Rendigo for He's like an alpha flight. Bad guy, he's like a key funk bad guy. I'm gonna use Sasquatch for my name from uh, Alpha Flight. It's funny how the smarter I get, the smarter the series got. Go and rescue Kitty from the key. Freaking ridiculous. You just can't do the same shit more. They, they really cared. To, they had a kid's mind back, back in the day. I kind of wish I was like an adult with that like, kind of mind. Adults back in the day, they didn't have the same mind as adults do now. When I die, everything's going to go back. I am the epitome of life. As it evolves and devolves, the high evolutionary, that's who I am. That's another guy that can use. I would be the high evolutionary. I am the high evolutionary. I have come to tell you about yourselves. I read you, I made you long ago, and I put the pieces of the puzzle together. Reavers. Oh my god, they would be awesome. Albert and uh, LCD, oh my god, they could, make, they could make a whole series. I'd love to be a part of it. I feel so much more like, I feel like I could do anything without my wife. I love my wife, don't get me wrong, but I'm only 36 and I knew it when I told her something deadly about it. No match for the real Wolverine. And I think you can take uh, Deadpool on and destroy him. Slice him to fish. Wolverine and Deadpool are equally cool in my, my uh, opinion. I, I know Deadpool's gaining a lot of ground, but he's like a wife tracker and shit. I was, I was a Deadpool fan before anyone was. Ridiculous. Who the hell are these, these freaking sentinels supposed to be? They're like master molds. I think there are some green ones in this one. It came out in like 93, 94. It's kind of like precursor to Apocalypse. Supposed to be a master mold. That's a cool looking uh, design, though, I must say. Nightcrawler's special is like freaking off the chain on this, too. I love the way it looks like holographic. So cool. Nightcrawler's Mystique Son. 
Scarlet Witch and Quicksilver are Magneto's children. The backstories are pretty awesome. They do uh, they did a good job with the backstories. Some of the names, I mean. I think there's still a lot of intelligence in the Celestial community. Look at that Dazzle, mm, baby. I want to see that booty. I want to be her next. It's not like the Asian games. You side scroll and beat them up. This is like a new level, but I mean, the Asians, they would have them in donks and shit. It's like, man. Looks like his card when he does that. It almost looks like Gamma's card. I have a uh, holographic edition of Gamma with the card too. That's going up in value a lot. Cut the black knot. Sinister Magneto and Apocalypse. That was epic. See, Magneto's voice in the, in the cartoon was a lot cooler. I mean, um, Apocalypse and uh, Sinister's voices were spot on in the cartoon. This is, this is based on a cartoon that uh, didn't didn't make it. There's a pilot out there you can find it called X Men. Um, I think Children of the Atom. But I have it very rare it's on VHS only. Somebody already beat me to a punch on that one, huh? I don't remember as, as a kid uh, those things having energy in them, but see that one just didn't have energy, any energy in them. Those like different color sentinels. They're the green ones. They're a lot light green like in the comic though. Someone already posted that on YouTube already though. Yet. I played it as a, as a Chuck E. Cheese with all my friends, four players, we beat, it, we beat the whole game like so many times, oh, it was so much fun. Yeah, the Reavers are coming now, out of his mouth. Those are cyborgs, created by Cameron Hodge, failing. I was able to control the failing, so I think he was like a uh, bio engineer, um, yeah, tech, techno well, engineer. They used him as the host. Warlock, there was a comic called Doug Lock. It was the, uh, Warlock and um, Doug, Rain uh, Doug the, uh, his last name, but, uh, he's... 
attached to the Warlocks and the Warlocks that do it together. Some kind of rhyme scheme. There she is. She could turn uh, light into sound. Uh, sound into light. Whoops. Yeah. She's underrated as fuck too. Underpowered too. X-Men, nice job. Magneto is over there. What the hell are you doing in the cave? Me. It's almost like he's like in on it. He's like with the oh, evil mutants in the other one. Oh, there he is. Yeah. I want to see that. The only problem is he wasn't on, on the other one. They showed Magneto. Uh, I mean, uh, Xavier with Magneto. That was fun to see. Before 
it's too late. Go after the giant sentinel. The giant sentinel. They're all giants.
I am Magneto, Master of Magnets. He pulls the adamantium from Wolverine, it's awesome. You are dead! You are dead! I had that issue with that one, it's gonna be a key issue there. And he turns into like a beast, kind of like after uh, issue 100. Goes back, they say they had a messy with controlling him. He's feeling sad. I thought it was kind of cool. Uh, he wore like a bandana and shit. But eventually that didn't really work. But I didn't like it. I like the electronic, electric Superman too. I thought that was really cool. I thought it was awesome. I had a pretty turn to that too. You are dead. I'm really surprised there's not more comic collectors out there. I think everyone should think of comics as like a form of, uh, you know, investment on top of just reading them. Wait, the game is not over. It pulls you through. Back to the beginning. Pretty cool. <laughs> Director Lee should be Stanley. <laughs> Always want to meet Stanley. Uh, I love all the comic books. It takes a lot of work and effort to make comics. Like and subscribe to my channel. CG777. Game, I know. I have this game right there. <laughs>